Opening day rosters announced across the National Hockey League on Monday here in Calgary. The group skating together for the first time. A number of practices leading up to the opening of the 21-22 season on Saturday. Well, it is opening night in the National Hockey League and a pair of games to kick off the 21-22 season. Of course, for the Calgary Flames, the focus will be on getting ready for that season or opener on Saturday in Edmonton, followed by the home opener here at the Scotiabank Saddledome against the Anaheim Ducks on Monday. In terms of their opening day roster, a 23-man squad plus Brad Richardson, who is added to the injury reserve, while well, all of them skating for the first time here at the Saddledome. There'll be plenty of practice time to uh, go through the reps, through some rotations, and get ready for Saturday. But a huge throw for one player in particular, Glenn Godden. Of course, he found out on Monday he was on the opening day roster for the first time in his career, 24 years of age, coming off a tremendous preseason in training camp, earning himself an opportunity to continue with the Calgary Flames to start the season. His focus now building from here on. Uh, it feels great. Um, I thought I had a good preseason, and obviously this summer this was my goal. So for it to, to happen right now, I'm happy, and I'm just uh, looking forward for what's next to come. As, uh, as camp and the preseason went on, did you get a feel that this might be trending in this direction, or was it still a, a bit of a pleasant surprise when you got the news? Uh, it was definitely a pleasant surprise. Um, I think throughout the uh, preseason, I was confident and comfortable with how I was playing, but I mean, nothing's for sure. Um, I think everyone knows that in the hockey world, so I was just trying to take it day by day and do what I could to uh, stick around. The exit meetings last year, I knew I, I had a chance, and I think that was a big focus, obviously, for the summer was, um, and they're saying you got a chance, that it's up to me to uh, go out there and take it. So uh, I trained pretty hard, and, um, yeah, I think it kind of worked out so far. You know, he's played at, a, at the higher end of the lineup and could get away with a lot of things that, uh, that you can't at the NHL level. So you have to understand where you're going to play and fill that role and then excel on it. And I think that was pretty clear to him at the end of the year last year. And, and then he worked at it this summer. A lot of that is mindset. It's not just getting quicker or getting stronger. Those are easy things to tell players. But a lot of it is, okay, this is how I'm going to play. And it doesn't mean I'm going to play opening night or, or during the year or be on the roster. None of that. That's got nothing to do with it. It's got to do with how am I going to play in the NHL? What do I have to do to play in the NHL? And that is as a third or fourth line guy or, or a uh, identity line guy, that type of player. So I think he did a good job of, of understanding that and then applying it, and then he had a good count. So still a couple of players that we didn't see on the ice today in terms of with the main group. So Tyler Pitlick still has not skated with uh, the main group. Uh, Michael Stone, the defenseman, one of eight guys on that opening day roster. He was put into COVID protocol, so was not on the ice skating as well with the Calgary Flames here today. And then obviously Brad Richardson, who, as mentioned, is on injury reserve. Still some time to work out a few different things and look at a few different options as we lead into Saturday. Lots of practice time upcoming at the Saddle Bowl.